please, as much as possible, be the clown in the room. Don't get angry. They start saying that, oh, I want to close. I'm tired. Beg. Say sorry. This is not the time for you to bring your pride, my dear. <laughs> Mellow down, eh? Do you have like this? Go and sigh and do it somewhere else. Not in those offices, okay? <laughs> hi guys welcome to my channel <laughs> so this is exactly how your registration process at the abuja campus should go for bar practice students there are going to be five five stops admission student affairs finance medical clearance and then accommodation okay so for the admissions you need these four documents actually five you need four copies of your school fees receipt, four copies of it, photocopies of it. You also need your full admission data page from your website, from your law school website. Print out at least three. Your posting, posting data page as well. Get at least three copies of it. Then your identification card. It might be your international passport. It might be your name. It might be your um driving license any form of identification you have you put it what is it are you shouting so these are the five documents you need you need four copies of your school fees receipt all right and then you need your full admission data page three copies of it then you need your posting posting document the data page okay you need Three copies of it then your means of identification either is your international passport your nin your driving license whatever it is you need it and then finally your medical certificate not just the certificate itself but also coming with test results and then your x-ray if you know what i mean and after the admissions you move to student affairs and after student affairs make sure that your school fees receipt is being stamped by the finance officer who's going to be on ground then you move to the medical part where you get your form and then you get cleared. Only when you are cleared from your medical, only when you are cleared from the clinic can you get accommodation. Okay? So that's it. But this is actually how it went. Add the chewing gum. Okay. You know, we'll get changed now. Why not? Now. Thank you. Uh -huh. Good night. Guess what day it is? It's registration day! I'm actually super excited. It's currently 7 07 and I'm waiting for my boot driver to get here so we get moving. Let me give you guys a quick outfit check. I would like it this phone now. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so excited. Maybe it's because after I registered, I'm coming back home. Who knows? In case you didn't know, I actually got posted to the Abuja campus. Yay! Good morning! Hello. <laughs> Say to you, sir. Abi, now you don't take busy now. Just they collect your money. And, uh, yeah, fine. No, we thank God. They are plenty like this. <laughs> Lord of Jesus. So when I arrived, we we're all supposed to be given a number, and that number signifies the order in which 
you will be called to come up to register at the admissions and when i got the lock link for me someone just gave me a random number 47 saying that she was waiting for her sister her sister was not here yet i should take the number i was like eh thank god do and immediately they called my number and i went inside Omo, <laughs> grace <laughs> We're actually supposed to start at 9 a.m. But after waiting for an hour plus, they decided to share the yellow form for us. And this form is basically what we are going to attach to those documents I mentioned earlier for us to get registered. And that took some time, right? It took like about an hour plus or two hours. And then I finished up and went to the student affairs immediately. Are you listening? It's now 12 and I just finished with admissions, student affairs and finance. I'm not going for my medicals. <laughs> I'm running on 10% energy. So I faint here. <laughs> so hungry. The, the, the system is too manual. That's why I was slow. If it was maybe digital a little bit, who knows, would have been done. I'm waiting to see the doctor. It's been a journey. Come on. Are you proud of it? <laughs> <laughs> so, who food did you give me? How? Can you imagine? <laughs> Do you, do you have chicken? I would have eaten it instead. <laughs> oh, Thank you. No fish or it's beef. Their beef is always hard. What? <laughs> I've seen you. It's seven hours in, and I'm still not done. No? A struggle with a spoon and a spaghetti. Very big one. <laughs> so, where is the other matter? Oh, God. I don't see 99 today. Remember one. I'm done with this school, to be very honest. Jesus. Is it licensed for boats? So I see literally when I enter, boy, all the glue on my face just disappeared. <laughs> So after all those gymnastics, I actually didn't get to completely register that day. Oh, well, the doctor asked me to go back and go get my test results. Apparently, my medical certificate was not enough. I needed test results, but it was enough in my bar one. But I don't know what happened. Shasha, I had to get back, get those results, get those test results, and then go back to services, which has been 
a terrific day indeed like it was stress stress the before and after of me entry that campus are coming out is just nothing to write home about and this is my take out from everything that happened is the fact that just be calm eh? if you are working with government officials or public officials anybody as far as they have the ability to change what you want right or affect you in any way please as much as possible be the clown in the room don't get angry they start saying that oh, i want to close i'm tired beg say sorry this is not the time for you to bring your pride as far as you don't have any sort of connection my dear <laughs> mellow down eh do you have like this go and sigh and do it somewhere else not in those offices okay be kind be respectful and just pray that you do your stuff sweetly um thank you all for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it um yes my moving in vlog is going to be going up very soon first day i love school you don't want to miss it so be sure to subscribe and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it see you next time